We recommend OpenLedger Stock Exchange for those who would like to buy CV coin. This is a decentralized platform with the highest security standards. Entering the home page, you can change the interface language choosing one from the list in the top right hand corner. To register, you should press the button Create an Account. After that, you will see the page where you are asked to choose an authorization model. There are several options, including a classical account model and an exotic wallet model as well. I recommend you to consider security and select a wallet model by pressing the appropriate button. Then you are offered to enter your login, which is your ID for any transactions, so that someone could transfer coins to your account. Your password is written below. There should be at least 20 symbols. Next, you press the button Create an Account. You are offered to make a reserved copy of the wallet on this page. It is better to follow this advice. After creating the file, press the button to download your file. After downloading, you'd better keep it in a safe place with a password. In case it is lost, you won't be able to recover the account. When the registration has been finished, you are authorized and can start working. After registration, you have to deposit your balance. You should change to an extended mode by pressing the appropriate button and then press the button Deposit Withdraw. You can deposit your balance with both coins and fiat money. I won't consider fiat money as it is not accessible at the moment. I'll dwell upon the coin option. So I press the button Deposit which is already activated and choose any available coin from the list. For example, let's work with Litecoin. Then I press a new address, get it and deposit the assigned address. After funds are deposited, you can start buying CV coin. I go to the tab Exchange. Here I choose a dollar in the tab Markets. Next I choose the tab Litecoin because I need to sell this coin at the moment. You can wait for a better offer or pay off a counter bid. But you can do otherwise if you have any time and the counter bid price does not suit you so make a bid by setting it in this window. Thus, to sell a Litecoin on a counter bid, it is necessary to press it and choose the balance at hand by pressing the appropriate button. The sum will be corrected up to the real sum of your balance, but not the whole sum of the given order. After that, the button Sell is activated. I press it and enter the password of my wallet Open the wallet and press the button Accept, but before that, I check all the data. After the transaction is successfully finished, you will see that I have bought $52 by selling my Litecoin. The same information is presented in the transaction history, that is, I have bought $52 by selling my Litecoin. Then I do the same in the tab CV Coin, but vice versa. If you want to put an order for buying, you can do it here. If you want to buy over the counter price, you can do it by paying off a counter bid accordingly. I press a counter bid. It is necessary to put a sum at hand. After that, 
the button Buy is activated. I buy by pressing this button. I check transaction data one more time and press Buy. After the coin has been bought, you can see that I have sold $52 and bought CV coin. To check the real balance, you go back to your account. Here, you can see CV coin on my account. To sell CV coin, I go back to the tab Exchange and choose the tab Dollars. You can put them on sale at a higher price, or you can satisfy the existing bid by buying a counter order. I won't lose time and buy the counter order. I enter the password. Check the data and sell. As you can see, I have sold part of my coins. There's some left on balance. Therefore, I have to pay off one more bid. But there are more coins and the button sell is not activated so it is necessary to correct the number of coins by pointing the available number. After that, I can press the button Sell. I check all the data and press Sell. Coins have been sold. Then I go in the opposite direction and buy Litecoin. This is one of the options to withdraw money from the exchange. You can use any other coin. Either you can put a buy order or satisfy the existing one. I do the same for $42. I correct the sum and press the button Buy. I check the data and confirm the transaction. The coin has been bought, which is shown in the transaction history. Next, I withdraw the coin. I press the button Withdraw. I choose the necessary coin, Litecoin, and press Withdraw Now. The pop-up window presents the quantity available and the wallet. The exchange accepts the given sum, so I press Withdraw. I check all the data and press Confirm. There is a message about withdrawing in the top right-hand corner. I close it and the withdraw window. Thus, I have withdrawn money. The account is practically empty as there is nothing left on the account. That is all. You can withdraw your funds safely and successfully.